Welcome back to KTSM 9 News at 6 from East Letta for our small town spotlight. I'm Colin Deaver with your sports report. Of course, the East Letta Indians, one of the oldest high schools in the entire region, built in 1927. They have battled for lower valley supremacy ever since. NFL players like Jim Price and Jesse Whittington among the distinguished alumni at East Letta High School. This year's East Letta football squad hoping to make some noise of their own. They are the subject of tonight's nine overtime high school football previews. Uh, Joe Martinez's bunch made the playoffs a year ago for the fourth consecutive of year bowing out in the first round to Amarillo Tascosa, but it was a young Isleta team out there last season. At one point, Martinez had to start 10 sophomores in the game. That paid off. They bring back 16 starters from a season ago, including junior quarterback Evan Martinez and two-way player DeAndre Jackson. If it all comes together, Isleta thinks they should be in the hunt for another playoff berth. It's a luxury because um, instead of installing a playbook, uh, we're focusing on technique. So we're, you know, weeks ahead of where we were last year at this time. So that just uh, it puts us, you know, at a big advantage. Uh, Going in into week zero, we're, we're in mid-season form already. My favorite part of it is probably the culture. The culture, um, just every day, you know what to expect. You know to put in 100%, and if you don't, then you won't get what you want. So that's what I like, the culture. Isleta will open the 2023 season with a big rivalry game as they host Riverside in the Battle for Texas 20 next Friday at 7 p.m. That is also the first night of the Borderlands Best High School Football Wrap-Up Show 9 over time. Tune in for the season premiere of 9OT at 10.15 my, uh, on August 25th with myself, Sam Guzman, Ed Stansbury, Jason Flores, and Andy Morgan.